Hello and welcome to Vibrant. My name is Siva Sivakumar, founder and CEO of Vibrant. We are based in Brisbane, Australia, and we are glad to bring this demonstration of the Vibrant system to you. Vibrant is a cloud-based rental management system used by hundreds of businesses all over the world to efficiently manage their rental operations. Vibrant consists of two main parts. One is the web-based system, and the other one is the comprehensive mobile app for iOS and Android that allows you to further streamline your rental operations. This demonstration will take approximately 20 to 30 minutes and um, will comprehensively cover all the key functions of the Vibrant system. So let's delve straight into the Vibrant system now. When you log into your Vibrant system, this is the main screen that you see. It's a calendar. The calendar not only shows what rentals are going out and coming back, it also gives you a lot more information. For example, it tells you whether your rentals have been invoiced or not. A simple tick box next to the rental number tells you whether the rental has been invoiced or not. It also tells you if you have um, um, quotations that has been sent out, have been confirmed, but not turned over into rentals yet. Anything in green is a confirmed quotation. Anything in brown or the gold color is a tentative quotation, which has not been turned into a rental yet. It also shows you some entries in yellow. These are basically reminders on your inventory. For example, this particular item, it has got um, a registration expiry coming up on that particular day. And, and that item also has a next stent tagging due on the day. And similarly, it has got the certification due, et cetera, on the day. So you can set all these reminders for your business um, as part of inventory and rentals, et cetera. And the system will show it to you on screen. Now, it also shows you any servicing or maintenance of equipment in gray color as well. Now, if you are a, a business owner who wants to see everything, then you can have all of these entries ticked on. However, if you are just managing the um, sales side of things or just the operation side of things and you don't want to see the servicing and other aspects of it, you can simply tick on or off the relevant entry. And Vibrant will only show you what is relevant to you. So you can have Vibrant configured with different users with some people wanting to see the whole thing and some people just choosing to see what they wanna see for their business as well. Now, we'll take um, the demonstration through what we call as a day in life of uh, a rental operations business. I've got a sample system here for an equipment rental business, uh, renting out access equipment such as scissor lifts, telehandlers, and um, other access equipment. Now, Vibrant integrates with accounting systems like Xero, MYOB, QuickBooks Online, et cetera. When you initially subscribe to Vibrant, you connect to these online systems online accounting systems through the screen. What does this mean for you though? This means that there is a duplication of data between Vibrant and your accounting system. That is, if you acquire a new asset in your accounting system, then the details flow in from your accounting system into zero. For example, if you use the purchase module in your zero system to buy new machinery, then that machinery data will come into Vibrant from your zero. Once you start renting the machinery to your customers and you want to raise invoices, then the invoices will go from Vibrant to zero. The integration between Vibrant and your accounting system is two-way. 
unlike other software systems, Vibrant provides full, true integration and two-way communication between Vibrant and your accounting package. Now, let's start the day. And we have an inquiry via phone or email. And your customer wants to know availability of equipment. Using this stock view screen, you can check on the availability of equipment at any point in time. Simply select the equipment you want to search by selecting the specific categories. Then you specify for which month you want to check availability and then click the search button. If equipment is not available, Vibrant shows you in red and in zero color. So we know which equipment it is. It's a large 5.5 meter scissor lift. So that equipment is not available for this period from 17 till 19 of November. However, the inquiry is for December. So we'll simply change the month to December and we'll search the availability again. System tells you it's just gone up for just one day, but otherwise the item is available for the rest of the month. Now that we have ascertained availability of the system, we can start to put together a quote or a proposal for a customer. We can specify who the customer is, their address, billing address, and we can specify where you are shipping the items to. For example, the item could be shipped to a different address or to a different locality completely. So you can specify these addresses. Vibrant allows you to maintain unlimited addresses for your customers. For example, if the customer is a builder and they have 20 different building sites around the place, you can maintain that as well. You can then specify what equipment you are quoting for this customer. So I've got a sample item here. So I want to search for another item. I'm going to search for some small scissor lips and maybe some compressor. I'm going to look at the availability and I'm also going to look at the images of the item. So I require this small scissor lip and I've got three available for this date period. So I'm just going to select this particular item and I'm going to use this item. Vibrant automatically brings these details across and I can save the line. If you charge your customers for things in addition to rentals, you can use what we call as custom charges within Vibrant, where you can add all of these. For example, installation, insurance, security deposit, all of those can be included in. So we've got sample ones like delivery charge and installation included in. When you are ready, you can simply save the quotation and you can email the quotation to your customer. You can maintain different templates for different purposes. So I'm just gonna use a quote template and I'm going to include my rental agreement and terms and conditions. Vibrant allows you to upload your rental agreement and terms and conditions directly into the system. Once you have these things uh, attached, simply click send email. Your customer will get an email looking like that, including a PDF with your company logo, the items that you're renting, including delivery installation, the total amount, and also include your terms and conditions and rental agreement details. So you can upload all of those into Vibe. Your customer can review all of these. And when they're ready to proceed, all they need to do is simply click accept quote. They will get a screen looking like this, where they can put in their purchase order number, and they can simply sign off on the quotation. 
They can also review the terms and conditions of rental agreement in here. And once they are happy, they can accept the quotation. You will get notified via email when the quotation is accepted by the customer. When the quotation is accepted, then you can convert the uh, quotation to a proper rental. Now, when you convert it over into a proper rental, that's when you can attach additional information to your rental. For example, you can specify the serial numbers attached to the items. So I'm gonna attach this specific serial number or an asset number. And you can also specify whether it's short-term rental or also as a long-term rental. And if it's a long-term rental, you can simply specify that there is no end date, that the item is going to go out, but you don't know when it's going to come back. So you can simply tick it on, and then Vibrant allows you to invoice on a monthly basis. Now, you can add other items or other details to the rental. And when you're ready to invoice your customer, you can simply click post to zero, or post to my or QuickBooks Online based on your accounting package. You can also email a tax invoice to your customer directly from Vibrant as well. Now, if you are a business that doesn't invoice as and when the rental goes out, you can also invoice um, the end of the week or end of the month or end of the fortnight, whatever suits your requirement. Simply go to this manage posting screen, select all your unposted rentals. You can select single, multiple or everything. You can then bulk post to your customers. You can also send an email confirmation to your customer as well with the tax invoice, if you want, you can include the terms and conditions and you can choose the template, etc. You can also bulk email the invoice to your customers. Now, Vibrant also has integration to Stripe as a payment gateway. So once you have Stripe connectivity established in Vibrant, you can also process a payment directly charging your customer's credit card or their bank account through the Stripe integration in Vibrant. So what does that mean for you? At the end of the week or end of the month, you simply click this button, bulk pay and post, and that will charge their credit card, raise an invoice, apply the payment to the invoice, and finalize the transaction. If for some reason, the payment has not gone through, you will be notified as to which payments went through and which payments did not go through. So you have an audit trail of what happened. Right, so this is the main web application in terms of creating a quote, creating um, a rental, checking your stock availability and other aspects of Vibrant system. Now, let us look at how you manage inventory in Vibrant as well. The inventory module allows you to maintain comprehensive data about your Vibrant system. You can search by different main category and subcategory. You can also maintain as a serial number item or as a bulk item. You can also specify the make, model, and other data about your equipment and what category it belongs to. You can then apply pricing for your equipment as well. daily rate, weekly rate, monthly rate, all of this you can maintain and track within Vibrant. If you have a unique 
rental period that you track by, for example, three days or four days, whatever it is, you can simply click create pre period type and you can specify the details and maintain those details in here. You can upload photos and other aspects um, of um, your equipment. For example, if you have the user guide or a manual or an occupational safety and health guide, you can upload all of these in Vibrant. You can also track asset numbers and serial numbers associated with your equipment. For example, this particular scissor lift, you can maintain its serial number. You can also specify its registration expiry, its certification due, and other details. The next test and tagging and all of that. Vibrant also has functionality to maintain inventory at different warehouse locations. For example, if you are a multi-location rental company with, um, with inventory in different cities or different um, suburbs within a city, then you can maintain different locations in Vibrant and maintain specific inventory at each location. Now, at any point in time, you can check on the history of the item. For example, how often did this item get rented, say, in the last year or so? You can simply search, and Vibrant tells you immediately that the equipment was rented seven times in the last year or so, generating about $43,000 in revenue. It's a very, very quick snapshot, but Vibrant provides complete analysis of your rentals, of your operations, from simple barcode reporting, um, extracting a list of barcode items through to what items are to be delivered and picked up, how much revenue you're generating for your equipment, servicing, maintenance history, so that at the, item, uh, at the time of item disposal, you have complete access to all your service history. Utilization reporting. You can extract comprehensive utilization reports, giving you deep analysis and giving you complete data as to whether your equipment is getting utilized 20% of the time or 80% of the time or 100% of the time. There is no decision based on gut feel anymore. Vibrant gives you comprehensive reporting unlike any other rental system out there. You can simply check on availability as a report. Some people would like to look at it on the screen, but some people would like to report. And you can find out also what items are rented by different customers, etc. Now, you can manually enter the data on this inventory screen, but we also give you an Excel template that allows you to put in all your equipment details and you can bring them over into Vibrant using this item import screen. Suppose you update your rental pricing every few months or every six months or 12 months, whatever, you don't have to go through and individually update each item's pricing. Just download the template for your serial number items or bulk items, update the details in Excel and import it back. It's as simple as that. Vibrant also allows you to maintain what we call as a kit or a package. The kit or a package uh, basically allows you to, um, you know, kind of bundle or, um, you know, manage other details about your equipment. For example, this main item includes um, these component items and things like that. So you can have a pricing at the main item level you can configure the details right from here and then maintain the pricing of the equipment and of the, your bundle or a package, et cetera. So far, I have shown you the main web screen of the system. Right, we have checked availability, we have prepared a quotation, converted to a rental, invoice the customer, now it's time for delivery. This is where the mobile app of Vibrant comes into play. So I will quickly 
show you the mobile app in Vibrant. So I'm going to stop sharing my main screen and I'm going to share my mobile screen. So I'm going to launch the Vibrant mobile app at the bottom. With the Vibrant mobile app, you can do delivery, you can do returns, you can track your inventory, and you can track um, other servicing and other things out of uh, the Vibrant mobile app. Okay, we have just raised an invoice and sent to the customer. Now we have to deliver the equipment to the customer. So I can simply click on delivery, and Vibrant will come and tell you what equipment need to be delivered. So I've got to look at from 1st of November to um, 30th of November, and I'm gonna look at what are the equipment to be delivered. So I've got these equipment to be delivered. Now, instead of using a mobile um, phone, some mapping function and things like that, I can simply click view map and that will launch the Google map functionality on your mobile device. And then you can see exactly where to go, what to um, deliver, and uh, you know, and things like that. You can also check what um, equipment you need to deliver for the customer. So I simply click the view button. I have to um, deliver these two items. I can check what equipment these are. I can simply click view image and Vibrant will come and show you that this is the equipment. Yes, that's the right equipment, so I'm delivering that. I can also check this one, and it tells you what equipment it is. I can deliver that. Now, either I can do it that way, or I can also read the barcode. It activates the uh, scanner um, um, a camera in your mobile device, and I can scan the equipment. And now I can, get the customer to accept it. I can get the customer to sign off on it. I can also take a photograph by simply clicking take photo button. I'm pretending I'm delivering my trusted printer that sits by my um, desk. I'm gonna take a photograph of this and I'm going to upload it. You can take up to 10 photographs for delivery and 10 photographs for the return. And I can also save the details of the rental, et cetera, at this stage. So what happens is the mobile app is compiling all the data in terms of what items I delivered, et cetera, taking, taking the pictures that I uh, took and uploading to the vibrant system on the web. So basically all of these takes few seconds and you'll get notified that the um, delivery has been completed. Then you can proceed to the next delivery. You can do the same thing on return as well. And also when you're performing servicing and things like that, you can select, okay, I'm doing the servicing of this equipment and I can select the product type, scaffolding, and I'm you know, moving from one side to another. So, and uh, you can change all of these things um, yourself. You can specify, I spent 1.5 hours transporting the equipment and you can get your customers to sign off on it so that staff in the office can start to um, charge the customers for this time spent as well. Okay, so this is what the Vibrant mobile app provides for you in terms of delivering equipment, taking customer signature, taking photographs and uploading it part, as part of the job, etc. I'll stop sharing my screen and we will go back to our main screen. Now, remember the rental that we um, delivered? We'll just open it up and we'll check if the details have come through. So, the signature that I took. On the mobile app, it comes through with the date stamp on it. And also, we have the delivery photos 
and is the photo of the printer that I took on my mobile phone. It has come through as well. So as you can see, combined with the mobile app and the comprehensive web application, Vibrant gives you complete control managing your rental operations more efficiently, track your inventory more um, uh, equally better, and also have your rental operations running smoothly. The final part of Vibrant that I wish to show you is the service and maintenance module. You can maintain details of the servicing performed on your equipment while they are at a customer site or while they are in the yard and you want to do regular servicing and things like that. Vibrant allows you to capture odometer readings or other machine readings, etc. For example, if you need to service every 200 hours, 500 hours, etc., Vibrant allows you to capture all of that and it provides you reminders on the calendar that the machinery is due for servicing and things like that. And you can act on it as and when um, the time permits. You can specify what spare parts to be used. You can specify any labor associated with it. You can charge some additional amounts for the customer if you like. Then you can specify the service tasks and any checklist to be performed. And you can print it and give it to your staff or print it as a record for um, um, your internal record keeping. If it is to be charged to the customer, simply click Create WCA and that will create the charge in, in your vibrant system and in your accounting package as well. Hopefully, Vibrant gives you the functionality that you've been looking for so far and help transform your rental business and take advantage of all these emerging technologies. Also, Vibrant has comprehensive application program interface, what we call as API, and also has plugins for WordPress and Shopify. You can download this from the Vibrant website and you can start using them to connect your website for online shopping, experience and other things for your customers. Please contact us for more details. We'll be happy to provide further details about our API and our plugins for WordPress and Shopify. This is what we wanted to show you today in terms of a brief demonstration. If you require any further information, please do not hesitate to contact us. Thanks very much.